Hey, church family. Have you ever wished that you could have a do-over? Have you ever wished that you could turn back time and start again? Regret is one of the worst feelings in the world. And most of us, if we're honest, would admit to having regrets over past actions and mistakes. The promise for the Christian given to us in 2 Corinthians 5, verse 17 is, Therefore, if anyone's in Christ, he's a new creation. The old is gone, the new has come. What does Paul mean when he says the old is gone and the new has come? Well, the old that he's referring to is the old life, the lost life, the life that was separated from God. That is what has passed away. What does he mean when he says the new has come? New means unused or unworn. We don't just receive a recycled life in Christ. We receive a brand new life. It's as if the old life never existed at all. And that is great news. Now, most directly, this verse is talking about the one-time gift of salvation. But for the Christian, God's grace is also something that we can experience new each day. Jeremiah, writing in Lamentations 3, tells us, that God's mercies are new every morning, and that is a reason to have great joy. We don't have to look back and regret. In Christ, we've been given the ultimate do-over. If you're carrying the burden of regret, I pray that you take that burden and lay it at the foot of the cross and embrace the newness of God's great mercy for you and me today. Amen.